Roland Daly, business edition tonight. We will end, try to entangle um, the things about Polish energetic system, how it works with Europe, what are the aims uh, both in Germany, Russia and Poland in order to develop the energy infrastructure based on the natural gas. Our expert is uh, Jerzy Bielewicz, financial analyst and uh, Gazeta Bankowa writer. So welcome to the show. Thank you for the invitation. Uh, it's a pleasure. And uh, let us say uh, only very recently the strategic project of Poland, the uh, Baltic pipe uh, that will develop, deliver uh, natural gas from the northern European gas fields in the North uh, Sea to Poland through Denmark got uh, financing from European Union. And yesterday we learned that uh, another project, LNG terminal in Świnoujście, uh, got the financing from EU as well. But this will be a ship-based infrastructure. So there are two project which involve natural gas and LNG, uh, which are of the most importance for Poland, Why? Uh, considering that uh, uh, we were at the end of uh, P Russian pipeline until now, and uh, we were quite often blackmailed by Russians. Uh, if we would not behave, they would uh, uh, turn off the uh, delivery of, of gas, or uh, they charge us 30%, uh, 40% more than, for example, our neighbor Germany. United Kingdom paid significantly less, although the transportation costs, there is another 1,200 kilometers from Warsaw to London. But anyway, they got uh, Russian gas cheaper, but they have a competitive uh, offer from other but, uh, countries, Poland was lacking this. And now we got this competitive offer from the United States and uh, this whole infrastructure is speeding up. Why is it speeding right now? What is so urgent uh, that we need the LNG from different directions? First of all, you have to remember that uh, there is another uh, pipeline, gas pipeline project, Nord Stream 2, uh, which is uh, competitive, which is uh, you know, the uh, basic idea is that the Germans will pay for the pipelines from Russia that does not lead to uh, Eastern Europe and will become a distribution center for the Russian, uh, for the Russian uh, resources in the Europe. So our interests uh, are different. Poland, Poland's interests are different than Germany's, yeah? And uh, we are strong enough in uh, European Union to force our energy projects. But we are not strong enough to block the Nord Stream, 2, Nord Stream 2 project, which is violating several European rules. Uh, not necessarily. The, the, the ball is still uh, in the in game. The uh, mm -hmm. So, um, uh, for example, Manfred Weber, uh, the potential uh, new chairman of uh, European Commission, uh, declared yesterday that uh, he, he is against Nord Stream 2 and he will do whatever it takes to stop it. Well, so I'm laughing see. because <laughs> I've heard that from the German uh, politicians and I also remember Angela Merkel saying that this is purely business and nothing to do with uh, any politics, but we know that Russians can turn the tap off to the countries they want to uh, Im Im imply some apply some pressure to. I would, so, I would say that uh, it's a real problem with Germany. They, they do what, one thing they should not have done because of history, because of uh, their experience, our experience during the Second World War. Uh, you've got to remember that uh, cooperation between Nazi Germany and uh, uh, Soviet Union uh, Soviet Russia uh, started the Second World War. Uh, if Poland was not attacked by both Germans and Russians, uh, Polish uh, Poland would uh, exist. The Holocaust would never happen. Uh, so. O kurwa, po prostu. Przepraszam. Tak. 
Tak. A to na żywo to szło? 5 minut mamy. <laughs> Czekaj, od mojego pytania, tak? A jakie było to moje pytanie? Nie pamiętamy. Dobra, ja, zacznijmy ja od pytania. Okay. Co? Ja sobie gadałem. Będziecie z, yy, od początku, czy będziecie... Nie, nie, od, od połowy, od połowy wejdziemy. E, czy możesz przypomnieć mi, jakie było moje pytanie, bo już byłem przy następnym. Moja odpowiedź była, że współpracują wbrew... Yy... Dobra, to... Wy... Tak, 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 tak. Jest konflikt. Dobra, ja zacznę od tego, że jest konflikt. Okej. Okay. Dobra. Dobra. So we can tell that there are in Europe at least two grand strategies. The one is the strategy of uh, Germany uh, strict cooperation with uh, Russia in order to deliver Russian energy resources to Europe and the conflicting uh, strategy uh, champion promoted by Poland that means we will work with the suppliers from other countries, in our case is United States, where we want to buy the LNG from in huge quantities in order to match the delivery of Russia. Uh, these are not comparable projects. Uh, the, the Nord Stream 2 is a very, very big project. Uh, it's 55 uh, billion uh, metric uh, um, of natural gas. Uh, uh, so, uh, compared to, let's say, uh, it's uh, three times bigger than uh, our projects, uh, LNG uh, terminal and uh, Baltic uh, uh, gas pipe. Uh, but uh, it, it plays a role in our region, uh, because uh, in case of uh, Russia misbehaving ag again, we can supply our neighbors, Baltic well, states, It Ukraine. also, even though the size of the project is way smaller than uh, the, the German-Russia project, it puts the cap to the price growth. Because if you have alternative, you cannot assess or, or grow your price up. Exactly. Your prices. That's, uh, that's, that's exactly our strategy, that uh, we have... Uh, uh, we will have different sources. We, we have right now different sources of gas and uh, there is a price competition and uh, we will never sign a new contract with Russia, uh, which would go against our interest. Uh, let's uh, remind uh, us about the The contract. famous uh, yeah. Valdemar Pavlak's contract of 2011, yes. I believe. Yes. And uh, it, it went against even uh, European Union uh, interest because um, uh, they opposed it. Yeah, Polish government uh, was just to sign this contract, but uh, then the European Union intervened and uh, said, no, 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 this, uh, this contract is uh, not good. You should not sign it. Uh, so uh, there are conflicting uh, interests between Germany and Poland, but still uh, on the European Union forum, uh, we can play our card and get what we want. This is still on the table that the negotiations are being led. We'll see how it will end, but uh, hopefully the result will be cheap and affordable uh, energy in the sufficient quantities delivered to Europe that will let our economies grow. That's our purpose. Which yeah, is the exactly. most important thing. Thank you very much. Uh, financial analyst uh, Jerzy Bielewicz was our guest and that was it for tonight's Poland Daily Business.